Okay, our assignment today is I'm going to show you how to paint a tree. Um, here's an example of what it might end up looking like. We are going to use cake temper paints, a large brush and a small brush, and watercolor paper. You could also use crayon if you want to get your lines on the branches. Actually, maybe I'll start with that. We'll see how it looks. So when I'm drawing my tree I'm kind of thinking of the letter Y and I start branching out from there the trunk of the tree is going to be a little bit thicker so I'll do some lines down there and I'm just kind of building out my tree spreading out the branches always thinking about the letter Y or V and that looks pretty good so I have to Wake up all my paints by putting a little bit of water. These are mostly white because I just did some painting. And um, let me see. I'll do the grass first. You don't have to do the grass first. But I'm going to like push down the paper and then kind of flick up with my brush to get some grass effects. And I'm using my big brush for this. You can use your little brush too, but it's going to take a little bit longer. So I'm going to clean my brush out, wipe the bristles, or as I say, wipe your feet so it's not too wet. I'm going to start with some yellow. I'm just going to dab up and down where I think some leaves might be. I'm kind of letting the texture of the brush show through. Or I like to say, I'm just kind of letting the brush do the work. All I'm doing is I'm dabbing pretty gently up and down and if I need a little more paint I just grab a little bit more and that's looking pretty good and I'm imagining maybe the Sun's like shining down on the top of the tree maybe I want a little bit of shadow kind of at the bottom where the Sun isn't hitting so I could grab brown or I'm going to try orange and see how that looks. I don't want too much, just a little bit. And I'll start dabbing that and letting it kind of blend in. I might have grabbed a little too much. I'm going to keep the top of the tree yellow. And do some shadow with this. I spread that out a little bit and yeah, that looks pretty good um let's see I'm gonna grab my little brush grab a couple or a little bit of yellow and maybe do some dabs of leaves falling and grab some orange maybe I'll have some orange leaves falling too my orange is pretty muddy. I should have cleaned my brush a little bit better. And if I want to, I can grab a little bit of bla uh, brown or black and just kind of paint where my tree is. The trunk. That looks pretty good. I'm just going to grab a little bit of blue and maybe just do a line of blue across. Just to kind of indicate we have some sky up here. 